It's Bonnie. Happy Sunday. I am back. Oh my goodness. The weather outside is getting a little, um, little scary. I hope actually, uh, Lenny can make it out of Cleveland tomorrow because it's starting to rain. And, um, now I'm seeing that the snow is moving in. I wasn't sure if it was going to get bad. I don't know what's going to happen tomorrow. Um, other than the fact that it's Cyber Monday, check it out. Entire store, Bath and Body Works 40% off which of course we knew, it's online and in store. They do this every year. The question is, what should you buy and what shouldn't you buy on Cyber Monday? So Bath & Body Works knows that people probably aren't gonna buy things like body care and soap because the price is gonna be a lot higher than like the buy three, get three. So what they do is three, can you see that? Three huge flash sales online only throughout the day. So we're going to talk about that too. So what is something that you should buy on Cyber Monday and what shouldn't you buy on Cyber Monday? That is the question. So we're going to start with the perfume. One thing that I don't like about Black Friday, especially on the higher ticketed items, is that you don't always want to buy six things. So perfume. Most people, unless they're gifting for a large amount of people, which some people are, you only want one perfume. And it's so much easier just to go, okay, 40% off. By the way, they also uh, are doing free shipping with the code CYBER. So it's a good day to stay home. If the weather is bad, if you're gonna spend $50, you're gonna get the free shipping. Let's start with the perfume. The Luminous Perfume, very pretty, very giftable. Um, or you can get it for yourself. These are $59.95. So I got my calculator here. $59.95 minus 40%, um, $35.97. So again, it always makes a difference on what you're spending overall because I know a lot of people are saving their money for candle day. So if you didn't want to buy six of these, uh, buy three, get three free, um, you can buy one on Cyber Monday for $35.97. So perfume is always a good deal on Cyber Monday. Other good deals are the gift sets. So check it out. Woohoo! This is so pretty, by the way. I love the book. These are nice. I might get a few more of these, actually. Um, these are $18.95. So if I do my math here, $18.95 minus uh, 40%. Eleven thirty-seven, and you got yourself a super cute gift. Um, so there's three minis in there. I'm gonna break that down. Divided by three, uh, you're paying three seventy-nine for each of the three minis, and you're getting the book. Um, it's not really a great deal. It's not bad actually for the minis, but I mean, you're getting the book. It's more of a gifty thing than for yourself, I would call it. Unless you just really wanna. It's actually kind of cool. I'm actually like if you put these on the shelf. <laughs> They'd make a really nice like Bath and Body Works decoration if you had all these books. I kind of like the book, actually. <laughs> now that I'm thinking about it, I'm like, I like books. <laughs> I might have to get some of those for myself. So that's kind of cool. Um, so the gifts are always a good deal. Laundry detergent. Oh my gosh, I gotta try this out. This is the Twisted Peppermint and Vanilla Bean Noel in the laundry detergent. These are retail, I think these are $19.95. So they were a better deal for Black Friday, especially with that 20% off. I gotta say that Black Friday deal with the 20% off was good. So $19.95 minus 40%, you're gonna pay $11.97 for one. Not terrible. And at least if you wanna just get one and try it out, it's not bad. So I would say uh, laundry detergent is not bad. Um, the refillable soaps, those are $13.95 minus 40%, um, $8.37. That's lower than the $9.99 they were doing the other. So if you just want one of those, again, not a bad deal. Pocket back holders, wallflower plugs. These are going to be great um, because these are $9.95. 9.95 minus 40%, uh, 597. If you just want to get like one pocket bag for yourself, like you're in the store, really good deal on Cyber Monday. And if memory serves me correct, um, there is not a code for Cyber Monday. So that means that you actually can get 
the 20% off if you have a coupon. So it might be worth going into the store and using your 20% off coupon. I know a lot of people are saving their coupons um, for candle day. So other things that you might want to get on Cyber Monday are candle holders. These are so hard to buy on um, Black Friday because they're, they're high priced. So for example, uh, the Santa Sleigh Globe, which is $89.95. I didn't even get that. $89.95 minus 40%. Uh, you're going to pay $53, which is still pricey, but it's way better than paying uh, the $89. Um, the Mouse Tree Single Wick Candle Holder is actually super cute. $24.95 minus 40%. You're going to pay $14.97. Way more reasonable than full price. So candle holders are always a good deal on Cyber Monday. So um, what's interesting, though, is what are these flash sales going to be? Because you're not going to want to buy body care. And Bath & Body Works knows that. They're doing $4.25 on Miss today. No one is going to do 40% off $16.95 on a miss tomorrow because that's going to be ridiculous. Sixteen ninety five minus forty percent, it's going to be like ten seventeen, and today they're four dollars and twenty five cents. So, I'm expecting some sort of body care sale tomorrow, maybe. Um, soap. Again, no one is going to buy soap for forty percent off because these are seven ninety five. Um, let me see, seven ninety five minus forty percent, uh, four seventy seven. Not a good deal on the soap. Which is why last year they did soap. Flash sale number one was the soap last year for two ninety five. Like I said, it would not surprise me if we saw like a body care sale in the five twenty five, five ninety five range. And then, if memory serves me correct on this one, I think the last one could be an additional twenty percent off. But they'll probably get rid of the free shipping. I don't know. That's kind of a wild card one. So the problem with these flash sales is uh, flash sales are you can't like combine them. <laughs> okay. So if you this is what they want you to do on Cyber Monday, they want you to place like three orders for each flash sale. So if you do the morning sale, you spend fifty dollars. You use the code Cyber. You get free shipping. You'll probably get like soap for two ninety five. Then there's probably going to be a midday body care sale. Do the body care, but you can't get the soap for two ninety five anymore. So then there'll probably be another deal later for like a twenty percent off. So once again, let's do the math. Say they did twenty percent off. So sixteen ninety five on the mist. Sixteen ninety five minus forty percent minus twenty percent. It's still going to be eight dollars and thirteen cents for like a mist. So again, not a good deal. Candles. Don't even think about doing candles on Cyber Monday. I don't think that they're going to do a huge candle sale as part of this flash sale on Cyber Monday. They got the twelve ninety five candle sale going on today. I'm sure they did a huge amount of sales. Uh, they probably want to do a little break on the candle sale. By the way, this smells really good. Peppermint hot chocolate. <laughs> so Cyber Monday is not a day to buy candles at all because we're coming into candle day on Friday the 1st. Wait until candle day to buy your candles. Cyber Monday is for other stuff. Um, let's see here. Laundry care. Um, any of the little things like the car fragrance clips are not bad on Cyber Monday. All of the stuff that's not necessarily for sale any other time of the year. Bath & Body Works has, do, has been doing these 40% off sales a lot more frequently. Usually they only did them on Cyber Monday and Easter Sunday, but we've had a couple of these nice 40% off sales throughout the year. So I think we're going to see them more as you know we go into um, 2024. By the way, I cannot believe, I'm looking at the calendar, it is November 26th. We are one month out from semi-annual sale. So a lot of people, and I noticed people commenting, a lot of people are waiting for semi-annual sale because it's only a month away. And unless you specifically need a gift for someone, a lot of people are stocked up already. We've had a lot of body care sales. Um, we've had, you know, Black Friday, 
We have body care day coming up. Um, a lot of people are just going to wait. And I totally get that. So it's one of those deals where, oh, here's another thing uh, that would be good. I actually got one of these. These are cute. Uh, I don't know if my, oh, my battery didn't um, run out. This is a train and it goes on top of the candle holder. Isn't this cute? I, I just had to get this. Um, this was, uh, I think these were, these were like 1995. It was like so pricey. I had a coupon, but I'm like, I want my train. <laughs> So this would be something good to get on Cyber Monday. Um, I don't even know if they're sold out. $19.95 minus 40%. Still $11.97, which is a, a lot better <laughs> than 19 This would make a cute gift, wouldn't it? I think that would be absolutely adorable. So anyway, um, do your math on Cyber Monday. Make sure that you're getting... Um, the deal that you want. Keep an eye online for the flash sales. And um, just keep in mind that Candle Day and Body Care Day and semi-annual sale are all rolling in. Anyway, I like, like to train. Um, by the way, if you could find this in the store, which I'm sure you probably can't, but if you did, that's like the deal of the century. Minus 250 minus 40%. It's like $150. That, I think, was this 200 or was it I don't even know what it was. My price tag is out on there. Maybe it was 200. I don't remember. 200 minus 40%. Uh, that'd be like 120. That'd be much better. Anyway, oh my gosh, you guys. Let me know what you're shopping for. Cyber Monday. I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye.